Let us now discuss about magnetic induction due to a magnetic pole. As we have discussed that magnetic induction is the force experienced by a unit magnetic north pole. So, if we are given with a magnetic pole of pole strength m, and we consider it as a north pole in nature, and say at a distance x from this pole at point p, we are required to find the magnetic induction due to this pole. And for this calculation, we place a test pole over here. We can define a test pole as a very small magnitude magnetic strength north pole. On which, due to this pole, a repulsive force F will act, and by Coulomb's law, we can write the value of F as k m m naught by x square. Now, in this situation, we can directly write magnetic induction at point P, which is due to this magnetic pole of strength m. This can be given as B is equals to F by m naught. So in magnitude it can be written as k m by x square, and if we substitute the value of k for free space, it is mu naught upon four pi m by x square. This is the magnitude of the magnetic induction due to a pole, point sized with the nature of north pole. The magnetic induction is k m by x square, and if it is south pole in nature. The magnetic induction will be towards the pole, which we already discussed, and this expression is also similar to that of electric field due to a point charge, which is k q by x square. So just be careful here. Also, we can define vectorially this magnetic induction. We can write as mu naught over four pi m by this can be written as x square into x cap so it can be written as x cube multiplied by x vector that is the vector form of magnetic induction due to a point magnetic pole in its surrounding at a distance x